Hello everybody, my name is that Joe Guy and welcome back to Oh no, I've spilled my tea on a map. Forbidden Oasis, here we go. Um you gonna give me to No? Nothing? Journal? No? No active anything? Okay, fine. Sure, just just freaking go. Travel. Uh who do we want to take today? Today I think I'm gonna go No. By the way, this is the worst character creation screen they've ever had. It's way too cumbersome. <laughs> I think I'm going to go, um, well, do you know what? We're taking shards. Let's take a Solus. Uh, I want to take Iron Bull just for the fun of it. And a Rogue, I will take, um, let's take Sarah. These are rumored to be Elven things, so I think the Elves may have some interesting way in here. Boogie boogie. And we begin our search today with a loading screen, which I will very briefly cut through. Interesting music. Come to join us at the Oasis? Hello. It's actually quite the site. It and the temple are further in. The temple? Have you learned anything more about the temple? Honestly, I don't like the feel of the place. No one does. Why not? Couldn't say. It's just a... feeling. Okay. Anything else I should know? Not much to tell. A mining company out of Valfremont used to have an interest here, but... economies change, and they moved on. Strange the miners never marked the temple on their maps. Discovered the desert edge. Interesting. Look at where we are. We're on Tatooine. Still, you sort of fit in already somehow. I don't know why. It's just clothes, I guess. What's up? Oh, hello. Hello. This might interest you, sir. What is it? Could prove useful, sir. Thanks. So let's see. Uh, Forbidden Oasis. The entrance to a mysterious temple the ancient elves called Solasun stands tall for boarding, for boarding and sealed in the middle of the Forbidden Oasis. It seems to have some connection to the strange shards scattered across Thedas, and we've got rifts in the oasis holding the oasis. There's only two camps in this whole place. Hmm. Seems easy. <laughs> mining requisition in the oasis, uh, mining operations in Nugskin. Hmm. Wait, they're here as well? <laughs> or do I need to get them somewhere else? Heat hunting Nugs. They're so adorable. In a kind of get away from me sort of way. The Temple of Pride. Uh, hang on, is that marked as my active one? Yes, it is. Okay, cool. So we got a camp here. We got rifts around and a camp there on its way to our quest destination. And a point of interest here. Let's check this out. Swing around, get the ocularium because that's thematically appropriate. Do you know what? Actually, that's a good way to end it. Do that and then do that. And then, uh, yes. Yes. Cool. Maybe quite a small... Blackwall? No? Just a random Inquisition scout. I didn't bring Blackwall. In the meantime, I brought Iron Bull, who looks amazing. <laughs> cool. Unfortunately, Sarah still doesn't have any armor. Uh, the only armor that was sort of available for her was the... <sighs> it was full on... The hell am I trying to say? It was Inquisition scout armor. That was it, yeah. And like, it just it just did not feel right for her to be dressed up like a soldier. Doesn't think didn't think she'd agree to that. So for now, we'll let her wear her own clothes, and she can just die. So here's a point of interest, apparently. And claim this bridge. I claim India for Britain. A footbridge constructed by the Enver's Mining Company. A few words are carved into. <clears throat> Excuse me. A few words are carved into a plank, only faintly visible in its weathered wood. Pass the time with another day. All the same, but you are in the pay. Ain't it just so? At least you get to be in a forbidden oasis while you work your menial job. In the meantime, the sand gets in my eyes and I want to cry. Death root Vitar, huh? Cool. Well, no time like the present. Iron Bull. It's nice to have a limited amount of party members again. No. Armor. Uh, six damage and attack and willpower. I like this. And I can claim this. Oh, and here's the ocularium anyway. Claim here too. 
Aries Peak, worn pillars, a sketch of the pillars followed by another drawing imagining the pillars as part of a grand monument with appended notes on the subject. The remains of the structure surely predate the Second Blight, perhaps older. My knowledge of ancient Imperial architecture is limited. There are some similarities, but I'm uncertain of their origin. One of the miners thinks they're elven. Of course, this is based on a few carvings he found that look sort of elfy. <laughs> the pillars are in, like, the ruins one sees in the Dales, of course. These would be much older than anything found there. Our Latin times, perhaps. Or perhaps different. An unknown faction. We don't need to visit the temple before knowing what this is about. Let's... Let's use this as an opportunity to have a look, but oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm once again just blown away with how these environments. Each one a picture. Ah, with difficult frame rate. There's another one. There's another one. Oh. Yeah, I can't believe I, I thought of ignoring this actually. What is that up there? It's like it lights up when I see it, but I can't... Could it be the temple? Huh. That's interesting. I need to remember that spot. Um, okay, next to those three pillars. What else? Oh, some iron. Excellent. Or maybe, you know what, maybe that's just one I already spotted. Yeah, that's it. I spotted it already. and That's all I didn't notice. There's another one over there. That looks like it could just be another ocularium, though. Come on, you're not as hard to find as you think you are. Ah! Uh -huh. One more. Searching too high, methinks. Just doing the briefest of scans. There we go. Wonderful. So now I can, uh, come out. There we go. Excellent, let's plot a course. So we got this here, Shards in the Oasis, which is good. And then this over here, like a side quest. And then this marks the rift that we were aiming for anyway. So this first, whatever this is. Make our way down. I love this game. Just this environment's just... I, I would honestly play this just to wander around the environment, you know? Just, it feels so rewarding and immersive and, and adventurous in and of itself. Up here, apparently, is some form of quest. Oh, it's probably down in the ditch. Which I do not see a way down to, and I do not fancy my chances simply dropping. Is there a ladder down or anything? Where would that lead to over there? Another shard. And there's a shard over there, too. Let's go grab it. It's real hard to navigate this area because of all the ups and downs. Oof, it has suddenly become very hay fevery. Must be allergic to progress. There we go, it's just over here. Enver's mining camp. Here we go. Just a couple of 15 shards here, huh? That seems high. An abandoned mining camp. This isn't scary at all. Big spider? No? Hello? Spiral mine. We are in agreement that the incident that took place last week in the spiral mine was an unfortunate accident. Condolences will be sent to Didot's wife along with pay owed. Hmm. I see the makings of a lantern over here. Ah, fungin! Now we're talking. Energize that magic lamp. Let it light our way. Let me itch my nose. Scratch my nose. My nose itches. 
There's a woman over there. What? What? A woman? What's that? Ah! Who are you? Why are you following me? I'm just looking for stuff to salvage. He used to work here. But I know no one needs it. Hey, hello. I'm with the Inquisition. Been out here a while. But I'll assume that's important. Doesn't explain why you're following me. I'm not following you, I'm following adventure. You came all the way out here to salvage old mining equipment. Mostly, I wanted to go into this one cave. Used to store stuff there. Damn thing wasn't overrun by spiders then. Excellent. Put my wedding ring there. <laughs> couldn't stand the sight of the thing. But I couldn't throw it away. Okay. Either. God, it was a stupid argument. Part of me knew I'd still want that ring. You didn't want your wedding ring, so you gave it to spiders? I'll leave you be. Right. See you then. Can I just ask, what exactly defines throwing away a ring if not leaving it somewhere where it's hard to get? Spiders, huh? We can handle spiders, probably. We have done in the past. I thought I saw one there for a second. Oh no, it's a fennec fox. And you guys get everywhere. Elizabeth's got what what the bloody hell am I? Um Shards in the Oasis. There's one down here. I guess this was the quest. I found it after all. But I feel like I missed a turn back here. Uh would you stop? Would you just go and know? So there's this here. Okay, uh, in that case, your thing, right? This? Shards in the Oasis? Where's your, um... Shards? 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 Is it this? Oh, yeah, right, it's over there. This one cave. So it's not this one cave, it's a cave elsewhere. <laughs> not this one cave, then. Fuck ladders. Okay, I mean, <laughs> I'm just gonna drop this here. Maybe it's worth holding on to for a different reason, but I couldn't think of what it must be. Deep mushrooms. Pretty gross growths, honestly. Canonize an inquisition as such. All right, let's, um, there's a camp just over here. Is that on the ridge or is that down? In kind of a confusing journey back and forth. Worn pillars, wooden bridge, Rift over there, camp up here. Let's go here. Goodness me, what a kerfuffle. Still, it's nice to explore. And this oasis, man. Yep, yep, camp, I see it up there. Blood blows, blood blows. Ah, uh, camping. <laughs> what are those pig things? Nugs. Don't ask, ever. Or mention, ever. Or give to Liliana, for that matter. Oh, sorry. What? Nothing to report, sir. Oh, okay. In that case, maybe start with the first half of your sentence again in the future, and then I won't go up to you thinking you've said report. Well, Magister Firestaff. Well, that's quite nice. It's not as nice as mine, but... It's pretty darn close. Oh, but it looks so cool! In a kind of... Frightening way. <laughs> um... Plus 2% attack, 70% uh, 10 chance to inflict immolate damage at 50% weapon power. That's pretty good on its own, honestly. Slightly less damage, but I get all this other stuff. Ah. Uh, I'll think about it. I'm fine with mine right now. I haven't used up any potions yet. So let's move on. We have a rift down here. Let's go take care of that. It's disturbingly close to our camp. Okay, what sort of thing have we got? Lesser Shades at level 7. I think we should be fine with that. Could you not? 
And you as well. Come on. Thanks, Iron Bill. You're drawing the threat now magnificently over there. Who are you and why are you in my face? Hi, Iron Bill. I feel like I can't call you anything for short. I'm gonna go disrupt that rift. I can't just yet, actually. Instead, I'm just gonna loot this guy. Huzzah! Shadow is up! Who's this? It's a wraith. I'm okay with this. Um, you're a lesser shade. You are. You know, let's go into tactical mode and get a good view of the battlefield here. There's nothing behind me, is there? No. In that case, this camera angle should be okay. Marcus, if you kindly move back here. Move yourself to the situation ever so slightly. Go in. Shit. Take myself out of tactical camera mode because I hit the wrong button. Uh, emulate these guys over here. Good, they're burning. You can go away. Uh, they're a little close. Iron Bull, can you do anything? Warcry? Yep, you just did. Cool. So where are you at the moment? So it's clicked on this lesser shade and now I can't unclick from it for some reason. Where is Iron Bull? Is that him? That's him there. So he can do that. That's excellent. What's this? It's a whirlwind. Use a whirlwind. Okay, so that, you've got a good amount of threat there. What about you? Wall of Ice? Just make it a little harder to get around. And as for you, I think you're fine for the most part. Get back to Marcus. What's he doing? He's got this guy in front of him, but I think that's about it. So just have at him. You know, Iron Bull's doing that thing again where he's like standing still. So jump. There you go. Apparently that's a thing to do with the trails thing that I specified. So maybe I'll turn that off. Oi. Cool. Better disrupt it. We're going again. Oh, close it, close it. Considering turning that tr trial off now that, it'll know, now that I know that it is making my guy stand still. It is an unfortunate thing. It should not be happening. Hmm. An interesting area. Already haunting in its own special way. I'm already going a little bit off course. Paragon's Luster, what's this? I do not know what this one is. Let's go back. Hey! Explored the start of this oasis. Found some resources. Close the rift. Happy days. I'm gonna make some good use. I'm drowning in iron because of all the places that I've been so far have been high in iron. Like shreddies. And hello? Holy fuck. Nope. Hyenas. We'll laugh your way somewhere else. Could you not panic near me, please? Mirage. Yes, I am drawing threat. Iron Bill. All right, they keep bloody coming. Move away. Me and trees in this game. We're gonna have a fallen out. Iron Bill, would you mind? Uh, your war cry is already used. So, uh. turn around. And you can actually just use it again. So do it. Trying to lose all your health. You use a whirlwind there. Actually, whirled them around in a weird way. Would hyena die? I mean, I know it's level eight and stuff, but geez. Uh, what else do we got around? We got that one over there, which is probably the the bear target. I think it did something good there. He's a low health. Iron Bull is. 
I think he'll last the fight. Oh no, he's already using automatically health potions, so we're good there. These guys take forever to go down. Congratulations, we have saved the Inquisition from a pack of wolves. Whoop. Iron Bull. I understand that among your people you are... What is the term? Ben Hasrath. Secret police. Spies, basically. You spied upon your own people. Is that so different from Orlay or Ferelden? They have all kinds of people policing them. What they say and do, yes. Not what they think. Hmm. What you think is what you say and do. No. Even the lowliest peasant may find freedom in the safety of her thoughts. You take even that. I'm actually inclined to agree. Sorry, I was muted there for a second. Freedom of thought is super important. With freedom of thought, we actually like make progress. Because if only one person is thinking for an entire population, then what if that person is wrong? The Kun is meant to be infallible, which is why they do this now. Jeezy, crazy. Your friends are dead. Let you join them. I wonder if these guys would have been hostile. <laughs> yes, we need multitudes of ideas and thinking in order to progress. The Kuhn may have been infallible at one point, and even that's a stretch, but times change. And we all must adapt by having new ideas. Let's rest up. And that will do it for this episode. Yes, progress is being made, and this place is amazing. This is all not news to you, I'm sure. Thank you very much for watching, I will see you in the next one.